appreciate the time and the, the knowledge that and experiences that uh, CD Usman Ali Al Qadri is sharing with us, and it is uh, them and their noble family that they are uh, sharing all of this experience and this knowledge to us in UK and around the world. In uh, his work in America at the moment, furthering this legacy of Huzur Qudwatul Awliya and and really uh, going to the grassroots and uh, raising raising the status of people with the name with the with the Fezan of Huzur Qudwatul Awliya. Huzur Qutbatul Awliya, the Shaksiya is such that you do not know you do not know where to start and where to finish. So, inshallah, with this, uh, we we will we will finish here. Inshallah, um, we will ask Huzur Sidi Osman Ali Al Qadri to make uh, a dua if he has any final words about Al Qudwa Institute, uh, and then we can inshallah conclude. Uh, Jazakallah, firstly, um, thank you for all those that watched, um, uh, you know, the show, this legacy of Wuzul Qudud and I would like to thank Maulana Hashim for, um, for accommodating me, um, even though I'm far away, um, approximately six or seven hours behind the UK time, but Alhamdulillah, you know, I'm very fortunate to be able to, you know, come on and join you guys and speak a little bit from whatever I can. Um, like I said, I'm not deserving of any title or any state or any nobility. All nobility is from Allah and His Messenger, sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Uh, and all that I've gained is from Huzur Wasal Azam uh, and his grandson, Huzur Qudud al Awliya, uh, radiallahu ta'ala. And uh, I just want to mention just the final points as well um, the legacy of Huzur Qudud al Awliya. How do we carry this legacy forward? Um, one way which we have carried it forward is, of course, through Al Qudwa Institute, uh, based in Putsi. Um, uh, in Bradford and between Bradford and Leeds. So uh, one thing we could do to learn more about them, come down, study the deen um, in the way that Huzur Qudut al um acclimated to us and, and told us and, and prophesied to us and how we should be as exemplary people, human beings, Sunni, Muslims and Qadris. Um, so that's one way we can um, follow in the footsteps. Uh, how, how else can we do? Love the Ahlul Bayt, love Sadat. Uh, and they were the Sayyidu Sadat, that even the Sayyids, like our families, went and bowed their heads um, in front of them. Um, their six children who are alive, uh, sorry, their six children uh, who Huzur had, one of them, uh, one of the daughters of Huzur Qudut al actually passed away um, one or two weeks ago, two weeks, I, I believe now. Um, and it was a very, very sad time for the family. So first and foremost, I'd like to um, send our Fatiha and Durud, everything that we have recited to their blessed soul, um, they will no doubt, you know, a part uh, of Huzur Qudus so no, no doubt they and two are blessed. Um, and we, we sent our uh, blessings and the Ruh to may Allah elevate her blessed Ruh soul in the gardens of Jannah and give her proximity to her grandfather, the noble messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam. And these are just a few of my words. Like I said, I've just been able to summarize a few things about the interest, the life, the family, and the legacy of Huzur Qudu Awliya. However, those that know him, those that spent time with him, and those that see him, um, they say that words cannot truly explain the feeling, the experience of firstly, what it was like to be in their presence, what it was like to be in their muridi, what it was like um, to hear their words. Um, and they continue to bless us. You know, me and you, we are both reaping from the Fezan of Huzur Qudu Awliya, even till this day in 2020. Me sat here in America and you sat in England, even though Huzur resides in Lahore. Um, and they were called to Lahore, even in their last, um, in their last safari akhirat, their last journey. Um, they were due, firstly, their brother said, bring Huzur to Baghdad and we will bury him alongside Huzur Ghosl Azam. That was the first thing. Um, and then their son, their eldest son, Sayyidina Mahmoud Muhyuddin al-Gilani, um, they saw Huzur Data Saab uh, request to bring Qudud al back to Lahore, where they started and where they ended uh, their blessed life in Lahore. And you know, their Mazar, you know, is a beautiful place. That's another way we can go and honor by visit visiting them um, and their family. And f finally, for myself as well, I pray um, that may Allah give us success uh, in order to emulate the legacy of Huzur Qudud al and their teachings and follow their teachings. May Allah bless all our uh, Ustads, Asadza, and all uh, of the students at Al-Qudwa Institute. May Allah bless all those people who keep us in your du'as and do du'a for the Institute, our work, um, uh, be in the community, or outside the community as well. 
um, and may Allah give us the tawfiq to truly follow in the footsteps of our of our teachers those are my final words inshallah we will conclude with a dua um, in the style in the way uh, the Huzur Qudrat Awliya would um, supplicate himself so inshallah we will uh, finish with this dua and uh, I request you all to keep me in your duas and, and my health my work my family uh, our institute and our students as well inshallah Allahumma salli ala sayyidina Muhammadin maadin wujudi wal karami wa alihi wa barik wa salam salatu wa salamu alayka ya sayyid ya rasulullah alhamdulillah 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 lazi yata muhammin ju'in wa amin ahmin khawf Allahu lazi yata muhammin ju'in wa amin ahmin khawf Allahumma inna nasta'ina wa bik wa natawakal wa alayk wa la ilaha anta la'u biswak اللهم صف عنا باع والبلاء وكذب ومرزا وسقط والديك والنكمة ون علينا والصحة والآفية والبركة والمغفرة ورحمة يا أرحم الراحمين اللهم عافنا وخعنا وبارك بنا ورزقنا ربي حاجاتنا ربنا عاتينا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وكن عذاب النار وكن عذاب القرز وكن عذاب المرز وكن عذاب الحشر وكن عذاب الميزان يا حي يا كيوم برحمتك استغيث اللهم ورزقنا زيارة المكة المكرمة اللهم ورزقنا زيارة المدينة المنورة اللهم استكامة طريقة الكادرية اللهم استكامة الشريعة محمد امداد کن امداد کن از رنج و غم آزاد کن در دین و دنیا شاہ کن یا شک سید عبد القادر جلال اشین اللہ اللہ مصر اسلام والمسلمین وعالی کلمت الحق و دین وقض الكفر واليهود والحنات مرحدین والمرض و دین والظالمین بجانبی محمد صلی اللہ علیہ وعلى آلہ وصحابی وعال بیت العجمعین و بجا غوث السکلین سيدنا شيخ عبد القادر الجيلاني رضي الله تعالى عنه وبالكافية العولياء والصالحين وننزل من القرآن مع الشفاء ورحمة المؤمنين برحمتك يا أرحم الراحمين بحق لا إله إلا الله محمد رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم